Hi Shoebox friends, this is Denise with D. Rogers. Welcome back to my channel for one final unboxing for Operation Christmas Child 2022. This is for a girl aged 10 to 14 and I'm calling this one Let's Be Mermaids. So let's take a look at what I packed. I'm using a regular shoebox. I've wrapped it in this really pretty mermaid paper that I got from the Home Goods store. And when she opens her box, it says, Jesus loves you. So just a really pretty visual for her. There's a real pretty blue bandana covering the top. This was from Hobby Lobby with some mermaids on top. And when she pulls this away, this is what she'll see. And right on top, I don't usually put this right on top, but it is right on top. She has a little organza bag with three pair of underwear. She has this beautiful mermaid. She's actually a Thai beanie. And let's see, what's her name? Her name is Lorelei. And her birthday's July 3rd. She's really pretty. She has this little purple crown on just long purple hair really pretty and I actually got her at my thrift shop new with tags and I can't remember the price but it was probably a dollar so I was really excited about her and then the next one is a beautiful seahorse and the seahorse is like a multicolor seahorse and this is his name is neon and he was also from my Thai beanie collection. So really pretty to go with her mermaid. She has two little organza bags with these little mermaid dolls inside. I recently got these at Walmart. I can't remember what the price was but it was like a big package of dolls and I think they came out to like 75 cents each or something like that. And then there's this one. So she has two smaller mermaids. Next, I see her card sitting here to a girl who sparkles with beauty and grace who lights up our lives with a smile of her face. And there's a mermaid on the front. And then our photo and our letter, personal letter, is on the inside. She has this little mermaid tail. This is actually a pencil pouch from the Dollar Tree. But I could never figure it out because I don't think pencils are that small, other than maybe mechanical pencils. But it's so pretty. It has like these little scales on it that go back and forth. And so I've stuffed it with a few things. So inside she has all of her hair accessories. So I've given her some dark blue and light blue hair ties. A very pretty pearl um, barrette and her ribbon is tucked in there. She can actually use the ribbon for many things. It has little seahorses on it. I think that was from the Dollar Tree this summer. She has three little pink um, hair coils that are stars. I think of them as starfish. And then she has a pretty headband with the same type of coloring throughout as her seahorse. And then a few more hair clips with the different colors of pinks, blues, and purples. She has a hygiene bag with a little purple um, pull. And these are um, actually soap savers that I get from Amazon. Inside she has a little hand crocheted face scrubby. I got this from Etsy and she has a bar of soap and a purple lip balm. She also has nail clippers and these very pretty nail files that I get from the Dollar Tree that say loved, beautiful, and brave. You can see this. These are my favorite from the Dollar Tree if you can find them. She has a Crayola coloring pack with a mermaid on the front. It says Mer Creatures. It has 20 coloring pages, a sticker sheet, 
and four crayons. That's what it looks like. I don't remember where. I probably got it from Dollar Tree, but it's very cute. Okay, so she has two shirts in here. Her first shirt is where I got the name for this box says, Let's Be Mermaids. And again, it has like the coloring of some of the items that I've chosen for the box. And I got this on clearance from Walmart online last January. I actually got two of these. Um, not the same one. The other one was a little bit different, but it was a two pack. And I think it was, um, I want to say it was $2.50, but I will look it up for you. This shirt I love is from Old Navy. It's a size 14, 16, and it's just a very sweet pink ribbed shirt with these little sleeves with a little frill on the end. And the reason I gave her two shirts is because this one actually looked a little bit small, which would fit great for a 10 year old, but I wasn't sure if she was 14, if it would fit. So I decided to give her two shirts so she has, if you know this fits her now, she can grow into this, and if it doesn't fit her, she has this one. That's probably overthinking it a little bit, but I had the space in the box and I decided to do it. Her next item is her pencil case. It's a light blue and blue pencil case. I think I got this one from Walgreens. And inside she has some skateboard stickers there's an anchor, a whale, a cute little octopus, and of course a little mermaid. She also has some nice erasers. Okay, so she has a big eraser that says I believe in you. And then she has some um, mermaid tail erasers, some um, little seashells, a shark, um, like a barracuda and some starfish and also a narwhal in there so all creatures of the sea she also has three pencil sharpeners and there's also a little hammerhead shark in here <laughs> and uh, four pencil caps and her pencils and pens are actually packed in her water bottle This is her water bottle, and on the front is a sticker of a seahorse that was from the Dollar Tree. I actually got this idea from Jeannie from Batman's Boxes. The water bottle is from Walmart, and you can find these in the athletic department, and they are relatively inexpensive. So inside here, she has all of her school supplies. All right, she has a toothbrush with a cap. Okay, she has a pink Sharpie, a mermaid pen with a little pretty little tail on it, a black, a blue, and a red pen. She has a blue gel pen with different colors in it. Lots of different pencils, more caps, some Ticonderoga, and um, three of these are actually mermaid pencils. So they have little mermaids on them. And this one, this one's a mermaid too. It says you are mermazing. This one says mermazing. These are pencils and pens. She has a glue stick. She has two erasers, a purple one and then a mermaid eraser. She also has a seahorse eraser. She has a highlighter, a pink highlighter. She has a little flute because this always reminds me of Ariel and her voice. So I included a little flute. She has another eraser. This is actually a narwhal little eraser. A pencil cap that's an octopus. She has a little doll that's a little mermaid, very tiny and her little flipper flips. More pencil caps, 
and across from Hobby Lobby. And the string that it comes on is also multicolored like her other items. Given her some jewelry in this little organza bag. And the first one is a little turtle bracelet. One of those little pull bracelets with a pretty little turtle on it and a purple cording. And then this was donated to me by a friend. This beautiful little purple medallion with this purple ribbon. So really pretty. All right, and next she has two pairs of socks, a pink, kind of a, kind of an orangey pink, and an aqua pair of Avia socks. She has a small little bead kit that I made for her, very tiny. She has a couple little mermaid items in here. This is a mermaid pen, like a multi-click pen. I got this from sheen.com. And this is a little mermaid eraser. I just recently got those and tucked them in. One more mermaid eraser. She has a mending kit, a set of playing cards. This is a little seashell from, this is from Easter. When you see Easter eggs, I pick up these little odd shaped ones that are like seashells or any characters. And inside her seashell, she has earrings. So she has actually mermaid earrings. And then these are mermaid tails. And this is actually a, like a clam shell. And these are starfish. That's all her earrings. Her notebook, really pretty little notebook. It has like raised gold sparkle on it and it's all mermaid tails. And I can't remember where I got this from, but it's a mead composition book and it is wide rolled. And I stuck inside stickers. So I've given her some fun mermaid narwhal llama stickers and then this set of stickers also came with its own type of skateboard stickers i don't know what these are like kitty mermaids <laughs> i don't know they're really funny but they're cute and then there's a mermaid She has this little mermaid book that I recently got from Big Lots um, and it's called, well it says Make Waves on it. It's just like a little notebook and, and each page is a picture of the mermaid, like a do it's kind of like a doodle book. She has a pair of scissors for school. She has some crayons and some colored pencils for coloring. She has these little gem stickers. I recently found these at Dollar Tree for 50 cents. She has a beautiful hairbrush. Um, I got this, um, it's called the Knot. It's a Conair brush. I don't remember where I got this from, but it's beautiful. It's a really nice quality hairbrush. I remember I got it for a really good deal. I just can't remember where, but that's her hairbrush. And then I made her backpack. Her um, drawstring backpack is made with this mermaid material. And it's got these drawstrings on the side. You just pull it at the top. And then it's knotted down here. So she has something to carry her things home in and she can use it for a backpack for school. She has a scratch and draw mermaid book. It's a rainbow and foil scratch off with pages inside. And it's, uh, I got this from, um, I can take the price off now. I got this from Marshall's for $3. So let's just take that sticker off. 
So you can scratch and draw Pretty Mermaid pictures using the stylus and special pages in this art activity book. It includes step-by-step -step drawing instructions, a mermaid story for you to complete, and doodle pages for you to try out your new art skills. So a really nice activity for her. Underneath that she has some more mermaid stickers. These were also from Big Lots this year. And these were, I think, a dollar for a package of stickers. And then these are some puffy mermaid stickers. She has a ruler. She has a pretty washcloth, pink and white, really soft striped washcloth. And then on the very bottom, she has two little notebooks. This one is You Are Mermazing. And this one says, Dive Deep for the Treasure You Seek. And I think these were from Dollar Tree. These are just like blank pages. I think there were like two or three in a package. It's either Dollar Tree or Target. So that completes my last unboxing for a girl aged 10 to 14. Let's be mermaids. If you enjoyed it, be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. I hope these unboxings all year long have helped you with your packing, inspired you, and I hope I helped you find some clearance deals. That's really my goal. Thank you so much for coming with me along on the journey. I know how much we all love to pack for Operation Christmas Child. It gives all of us so much joy. So I will see you in 2023 with some more unboxings. I might do a clearance haul in between or my experience at the Processing Center. But until then, I'll see all of you definitely in 2023. So have a very happy holiday. God bless you, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.